Let's talk just numbers here. What was your weight at your highest peak? The highest I ever saw it factually was 536, and that was on a freight scale, because back then there weren't scales that really went that high in doctor's offices. And so I had to go get my weight uh, checked at a shipping center, and I was 536. What was your relationship with food back then at your peak? I was embarrassed to eat in public, so I did the majority of my eating kind of alone at night. I knew all the 24-hour drive-throughs in Los Angeles, and I really ate to the point of almost intoxication. Name the diet, Ethan Supley has tried it, but he says he's finally found long-term success. So what finally worked for you? What's the secret? The thing that I've really lately figured out is the idea of taking diet breaks and maintenance periods. And most of the diets run in a very linear fashion where you're working towards a goal, you achieve the goal, and then the idea is that you're kind of fixed. And I have found that to not be true. Instead, he uses a combination of workouts, willpower, and watching calories while still eating six meals a day that he preps ahead of time. What do you eat? What is your, like, daily? Basically, I'm just tracking my calories and I'm on a low fat, high protein, moderate carb diet. His incredible body transformation landed him on menshealth.com. You are like shredded <laughs> in men's health. You are ripped. Why was it important to you to not have any retouches done on the photos? A big part of massive weight loss is loose skin and it's not really discussed as much as I think it should be. Health over vanity. Ethan said he changed his lifestyle for the sake of his four daughters and wife. Let's talk about this love story with Brandy. You two met when you were 16. We need to hear about this and how she supported you through all of the ups and downs. We became very, very, very close friends and I was utterly in love with her and <laughs> she was like not totally into me and then we came back together in 2001 for the very first time i was felt totally accepted for who i was versus what i looked like i want to talk a little bit of the hollywood part of this now your former co-stars right i want to hear the reaction from then leo is actually one of my oldest friends and he's been rooting for me the whole time so he's very happy i've heard from some of the my name is earl guys they all seem to be very happy i think on personal levels everybody's really happy and supportive because i think they can get a sense that i'm i'm certainly more satisfied with myself now and are you happy to... i'm very happy